Hey guys and welcome back to Blood and Bones and we are here today. Where are we? We're here. We're somewhere here. Anyway. Uh, so what what are we gonna do? We're gonna open up this. Oh my god, what the hell is that? And why is it there? Hmm. Yeah, chunks are not loading. I suppose we can see on the ground. Any diamonds? Any diamonds? <laughs> uh, we need to get moving and start getting food. I don't want to go up to that thing. Uh, maybe we could go up to the island and explore maybe a little bit. But there's no wood there. I need wood. Well, we're just going to have to take the plunge and hope for the best. Hope that we don't get killed by that. Or hopefully that thing doesn't see us and we can get out of its loading distance. So when that zombie spawner will be good as well. So then we can get loads and loads of uh, zombies for food, like food purposes. Because you can use their meat for so many different ways. You can eat it normally. But I think that gives you hunger. But it's not... Well, no, it, that wouldn't be a beneficial actually. Because hunger in this, even if you move, it goes down. So it's still going to wreck you. I need to just get over here. Uh, yeah, this is... I'm going to have to build some place or something to get up and down from. Right, tonight we need to build ourselves a shovel. So we can get uh, a juicer and stuff like that. So yeah, we're going to do that tonight. Okay, let's get some wood. Right, come on, there we go. And we need to get some stone too, because otherwise we're going to get wrecked. So we need to get stone and wood. This the grass is just gonna get on my nerves, man. I'm not even joking. Too much. Oh, the bird, the cobalt. Okay. We had some stuff on them, so that's good. Oh, some cows. We could kill them and get some stuff. Or we could make a cow, uh, cow, like breeder spawner thing. Decisions, decisions. Lots of wood around here. Let's go grab. Let's go grab some, like a ton of wood for the moment. Let's just focus on wood and food, just for the moment. Like, oh, this is going to be kind of a pain. I bet you. Come on, don't don't give me that lag. Don't give me that lag. It's not what I want, man. There we go. It's got coming back. It's coming back. We're coming back. Okay, come on. We need to just grab plenty of this wood. And as well, guys, if you haven't played Blood and Bones before, one thing you should know is the weight and how much you carry does affect you. I haven't gone done this in hardcore at the moment because mostly because I didn't want to. Like hardcore is ridiculously hard and I'd probably die within the first couple of hours and lose all my progress. I know there are some people who, who've done this in hardcore mode and yeah complete and utter total respect to them. I mean seriously. Don't know how they've done it. But for me I, I don't think I could do this in hardcore mode, so I'm going to stick to my nice and normal. I mean, it's still hard, but it's not hardcore. And hard, but hardcore I think is ridiculously hard anyway. So, right, we need to grab shovel. We need to grab food. Just grab food today. Now, We've got tons of wood. We need to grab some stone. I need to stop eating as well when the thing is completely out. Oh, if I attack one of these pigs, all these pigs will attack me. That's one of the biggest problems as well. How many hearts do they have? They have 10 HP. This only does like 5 damage. Sheeps will be no good as well. Let's grab some stone actually. That would be a good idea. We can start like getting... Thing. So let's get this. Like this. And I'm going to try to kill one of these pigs I think. Uh, I thought that pick would attack me, but apparently he didn't. Normally they do, but phew, I'll take it, man. I'll take it. I'll take all the help I get at the moment. Alright, here we go. Gonna get enough for a furnace. Uh, some. Just gonna get plenty, like all we need at the moment. Like, I would like to start on Tinkerer's Construct, like the actual in depth bit, but for that we need clay which we'll find in these rivers which are around us real easy uh, we also need right, there we go and we've got 16 
probably need a little bit more than that. Uh, let's grab just a little bit more. There we go. Right. Right. Let's grab some more food if we can. I want. I just. I, what the? Who hit me? I don't know. I think it was the pig, but I don't know. Alright. Alright, come on. I'm just keeping an eye on my food at the moment. Like, and how much it actually restores my HP. Which is really annoying. To have to t this is really annoying. This grass, man. I picked a really bad biome to stay in for the moment. <coughs> oh, yes. Going over there. Gonna get that. Gonna get that. And then we're gonna head back home. Head back to the house. So let's grab this. Because we definitely want this. Like. Coal is a good thing. Coal as well also releases that stupid gas as well. So we've got to be careful to suffocate ourselves or anything. Or we don't hold a naked flame to it. Naked flame's bad. Okay. <coughs> Alright, come on. Alright, that, 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 I guess that would have to do because I can't find any more coal for the moment. We'll get loads later, I'm not too worried, like... I'm gonna get tons of stuff later, it's just... Any, any, any... I'm gonna head back home quick. But, we could do with a shovel, we've got to repair this axe as well, it's just broken. Yeah, we definitely need a bit of, uh, an axe. Oh, come on, get up that hill. Daddy! Right, come on. Daddy. Oh, chicken! Daddy. Uh, chicken. Daddy. Okay. I wonder if there's chickens. Like. Okay, I killed the chicken. They don't seem to be angry with me, so I'm gonna take that as a plus and run away. Yay, yay, yay. This is not good. Yes, well, that's, that's a weird coloured water. That's not going there. Yeah, we're definitely hungry. Well, we have enough wood, though. Right, where is the sun? I can't see the sun. I mean, is it because my render distance is on short? Take a quick look. Uh, oh, it's because it's on short. Okay. Gonna have to definitely keep that on normal then. We have a bit. We do have a bit of daytime left, so let's just grab sand for the moment. Like, because that's one of the things we need as well. Plenty of sand. We can get our Tinkerer's Construct thing up and running. Soon, hopefully. Probably not this episode, probably next episode, but... Definitely going to try to get it done by next episode. Come on. Oh, come on, slowness, seriously. It's getting... It's just so annoying. Alright, come on, eat up. Looking at that island, and the island looks really good. Like, it doesn't look too big, too high. So, yeah. That's definitely going to be our next stop. It's definitely going to be that island, I think. Definitely want to build a base. Maybe we should build like a fort fortified castle on that on that on that place. Whoa, the frames drop. Mobs must be like just spawning under us or something. Wouldn't surprise me. That's probably what it is. All right, here we go. Get in here. There we go. Just change this video settings down because. I don't know what's wrong with this, I mean, seriously. There we go. Like, I don't mind playing on small settings, it's just... I don't like... the way it keeps 
the, the frames say 30, then it drops to like nothing in two seconds. I'm just like, but sir, you didn't say that just now. Right, here we go. Just dish, 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 dish. Put all these seeds away. Probably not going to be using hardly any of these seeds, but could prove useful. Need that stick. Uh, we're going to need a pattern. So let's make half of this into that. Let's make half of these into sticks. Let's make two patterns, I reckon. I'm going to need more because I want to make a sword. No, you can't make a sword out of flint, so we can't make a sword. Hmm. Just yet. So we're going to leave that for now. Here we go. And we need... Let's grab a tool rod because making tool rods um, makes things tougher. Uh, there, and then we put a tool rod in there. We put a stick. A stick is more powerful than a tool rod, apparently. Uh, there we go. Tool rod. Uh, shovel head. We need we need our, our, our flint, which we have some of, which is good. So let's get our flint up there. Right now, let's start work. Get our shovel going, so tomorrow we can get out, get to the snowy place, start grabbing some stuff. Is it this one I do it in? Yeah, I do. Okay, that's my axe repaired. Not too worried about my pickaxe just yet. We should always carry one of these with us, really, tool station, so then we can quite easily make everything. Could do with a chest. Uh, there is a way to make a patterns chest, so I'm going to make, quickly make a patterns chest. Because that will hold all my patterns and I don't have to... What, like... Oh, wait a minute, is it a chest, then a pattern on top of that chest? Yeah, there we go, a patterns chest. And we're going to need another chest, so let's make one more chest. We can also make, if I'm correct, which I am definitely correct, I know I am. We can actually make some wooden armour. So that's that could be a good thing to have. For now. Alright, there we go. We can put stuff in here. We're going to brighten up this place in a second. I'm just trying to get everything out. And my mouse is playing me up. Like, it's, it's, oh, it's not the mouse. Sorry, guys. It's not the mouse. It's it's my mat, mouse mat. It's, it's not a mouse mat. So it's kind of playing me up. And it's quite annoying, to be honest. There we go, that's a really nice place to have that. Unfortunately, like we're going to have to get over to the island before we set up Tinker's Construct, I think. Unless we set it up on the roof, which I might do, actually. Because that would be a nice, easy place to set it up. Unfortunately... I actually just got scared then. Like, I just stopped, I was like, oh, damn. And unfortunately, I don't think... I think that we might be in trouble because of the manticores from over there. So you might have to create like a little roof. Which could suck a little bit, but... It's fine, it's fine. Right, let's create ourselves a quick furnace. There we go, a nice little furnace for us. We'll put that there. Right, what we need to do is... What do we need to do? We need to cook our food, that's it. Right, let's cook this, this just for now. Put that in there. Right. What I want to do, the reason why I'm cooking that is because I want... Is it it's two sticks? That's it. There is a way to get more, but you need rubber, which I don't have rubber at the moment, so. There we go. As I said to you guys in the last episode, we're going to get some co co coal, and we're going to light this place up. Like, I looked at the video, well, I'm, post I'm posting today, I think, which I haven't like, and it was quite dark. So, I did say that I would brighten this place up a lot, so I'm going to try to do that now, like, hopefully this, this has helped a lot, I mean if I'm looking around now there shouldn't be too much dark patches, maybe a bit there, but there we go, so let me come down here, put one on the stairs, I'm going to start just brightening this place up, like, sort of like that, right, so yeah, we get more torches later and we'll brighten up even more. 
It would be okay if this was a cobblestone tower, but I think they took all the cobblestone towers out. I mean, not the cobblestone, there they are, stone brick towers. Because I think people were repairing them and they just kept blowing up, so fair enough. So what can we do for the night? I mean, I don't think we've got anything else to do tonight, apart from put that away. <gasps> we do, we do, we do have something else to do. Let's make some... We need three, so we might need to put another plank of wood in there. Yeah, we'll need one more plank. So yeah, we'll need three. Because what I want to do is make a juicer to make uh, smoothies and juice straight away. As soon as possible to get my food going really strong. As well, like, some of this food is not going to be able to juice. This kiwi will be able to juice. This we can't juice. We can juice, but we can't smoothie. And we can't smoothie spices or seaweed, I don't think. We can do that to apples, so that's okay. And we can also to blackberries. Blueberries, sorry. So, I'm going to... The food struggle is going to be real. I mean, if I'm looking around... There's <gasps> a village. That could be GG win. Like, seriously, last time I was on here and I got villagers, it was GG win straight away. But what we need to do before we go, we can go to that village, we can grab the crops, grab the stuff in the houses, but we must get away from it out of rent distance by night time. Because, if you can hear my door in the background, because the monsters will just wreck the villagers and I want to keep the villagers for a reason. If we get the safari catch like last series, we can use those villagers to get everything in the game. Like, we can just skip straight to Cobalt level armor. It's like a cheat, but yeah, it's it's a pretty, pretty um, interesting way to do it. How much hunger does this restore? One. That really does suck. Is there anything I can do to help that along? Like, what's this, pork? Right. Pork. Let's just type in pork. See what we come up with. So we got breaded pork. Uh, yeah, we can't create any of this until we have Tinker's Construct up and going. Uh, spicy mustard pork? No, we need sand Tinker's. No, unfortunately we can't. I don't think we can do much else with it. Which does suck a little bit, but oh well. Uh, oh, one thing we might be able to do. Um, this is not tested, and I'm not 100% sure, but I think you can sit in a chair without losing hunger. Like, you can sit on a horse. So, so I'm not sure if that's true, so yeah. Can't remember if I tested this in the last series or not. Ah, maybe they took it out. Um they took all the chairs in out. What about Oh whoops. Come on man. It's not a stall. Uh, I don't know, I don't think they have anything in here, unfortunately. Let's just take a look at the seat. So far, no, I don't. I'm pretty sure I don't have anything in here. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think I would have to stall, but I, maybe I should check that anyway. So, just in case, like, no, I probably spelled stall wrong there. And I look like an idiot, but eh, well, cooked maca ma maca meat. Nah, some of this is nah. As well, I want to know if you can go to the tw like Twilight Forest as well. I haven't actually done it myself, but I wonder if you can. Like, I haven't really looked into this mod hugely, so I don't really know. We need to not. I need to not move around as much as possible at the moment. I mean, seriously, my hunger is terrible. Right, we've got three. Let's put this in here because this will degrade my hunger fast as well. So, if I'm correct. That should be a juicer. Or is it that way? That way. Okay, juicer, there we go. So we have a juicer. So can we make juice right now, or do we need the bowls? I can't remember. <gasps> yes! Two, three, make some juice quick. So we're going to save some for uh, making into... Uh, what should we call it? Get some juice. Make into, make For making into smoothies, so... Yeah, take that. And we'll take them because I think we can make this into into juice, but not smoothies. No, we can't make this into. Anything, but I think you can make them into candles as well, which is pretty cool. Wow, guys! So 
Oh, okay, it's coming to daytime now. Now, to be honest, we're pretty much done for today. Like, we have a full hunger bar. Like, somehow we do. I don't know how we pulled that off there. Yeah. We have a full hunger bar, and we're going to head out on a journey uh, today, and we're going to make try get to that uh, the snow place. So, I guess I'm going to call it here, guys, the episode. And, yeah, I guess I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode. Uh, another little thing I just remembered. Uh, if I go clock, I can actually see the time. Which is really nice for me. Because then, as you can see, I can tell the time. I don't have to like, look at the sun all the time or anything like that. Just press E and I can see the clock. So until next time, guys, I guess I'll see you later. And have a good day, wherever you're doing. Until then, until next time, see you later. And goodbye.